As a follow-up to our solving of the RCMP, we forgot to solve the acronym RCMP. Well, that's an obvious three-fest, because RCMP equals 50, which is the third prime, five, times the third prime, doubled. 50 glorifies the number three, because it's an all-factor five number, and five is the third prime. Okay, five times five, doubled. Third prime times third prime, doubled. And, of course, basically every letter in there, R divides by three, C is three, M is 13, which glorifies the number three, P, all-factor six, I could go on. Um, and then when you say the RCMP, you add 33 points on top of this 50, which makes 83, which is the 23rd prime, which is in turn the 9th prime, 3 times 3. So whether you say RCMP or th the RCMP or, most importantly, Royal Canadian Mounted Police, the pure three fest of all time, add the in front to make it 303, it's a three heaven. By divine ordinance, the glory of the Trinity. Of course, the very bad, just so screaming out the number three in its artistic design, it's not even funny. And we have a police force that doesn't even understand that God is three persons. That is the greatest tragedy that exists on earth today. I will say it again. The greatest tragedy that exists on earth today is not someone stealing money from a bank. It's not someone stealing money from a candy store. Because that happened as a result of that person not confessing Jesus Christ as God as a child. And now they are a slave of sin. And now they can't control demons coming at them saying, I want you to rob this bank. Stop being a bunch of idiots. This is all retardedness. Our education system needs to get fixed. If the police force doesn't even know that Jesus Christ is God, how are they going to be free from sin? You know, it's, it's <laughs> the sin of greed. I mean, there are tons of people working in the police force that just do so for a paycheck. Okay, because they don't have the spirit of God. <laughs> They're just doing it because they like the money. <sighs> Goodness gracious. Man is sinful apart from the Spirit of God. People need to get filled with the Holy Ghost, and then they work for the police force because they're motivated for justice. They're motivated to protect the people. They're full of love for the people. They're, they treat people with incredible kindness. They got big smiles on their faces. They got, you know, they're keeping their bodies in excellent shape. They're, they're full of love. Jesus was full of love more than anything in the universe. <laughs> like, you don't need any violence. <laughs> Above all, a police officer should be an excellent counselor, someone filled with the Holy Ghost, a person who's able to handle disputes and with grace and intelligence. So, um, <laughs> how fascinating that the word law divides by three in three letters and nine strokes. Hello, how can you defend the law if you don't, know, don't even confess that God is three people? You can't even say the word law without glorifying the Trinity. And le oh look, there's another word sitting right there in French that screams out the number three. It's bookended with 24 and every center letter divides by three. How much more do you want? God is going to rebuke people. Like, it's going to be embarrassing. You can solve all the text on this badge. You can like knit it all together. It's like, what is that? That looks like an ox to me. Ox is O-X, which, which is 15 plus 24. Both letters divide by three. You can solve every detail of this. Of course, they are beneath the monarch. Monarch divides by three. Sovereign divides by three. Her name is Elizabeth Alexandra Mary, which is 15 times 15 by birth. She's on the top. You, Mr. Police Officer, are down here. If you don't submit to the top, who is the heir of the throne of David, God is ultimately going to send you to hell. And your name is going to be blown away as nothing in world history. And you're going to have no honor on Judgment Day. That is the truth. I am speaking the truth. And he that hears the truth will take heed and will be wise and seek the living God today and repent before Jesus Christ and call upon God for his sin. You do not go to heaven with your head held high. You get into heaven by pounding your chest and saying, God, be merciful to me, a sinner. It's called repentance, humbleness, getting down on your knees, saying, Lord, I am a sinner. Have mercy upon me. You can count the number of leaves in this badge. And you get one, two, three, four, five, six on the left. Three plus three. One, two, three, four, five, six on the right. Oh, look, leaf divides by three. It's 24 triple eight. Tree is a double of it. Leaves branch in threes because God is three persons. What are these emblems on the crown? It's a fleur de lis. That adds to one, one, one perfectly. A gold crown divides by three. And on and on and on. Royal Canadian Mounted Police. That is what is officially written on your badge, sir, ma'am. Do you confess that Jesus Christ is God? If you don't, you, you, are, you are blind. You are blind, and you need to pass a new examination in order to be worthy of this badge. How many threes can you find in this badge? That will officially be one of the tests on the examination. Why are those threes there? Because this whole story exists for the glory of the triune God. Why are you here? 
Because you exist for the glory of the triune God. God the Father, Jesus Christ, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, who is love. How should you treat people when you go out as a police officer? With love. In obedience to all the commands of Jesus. How will you know how to obey all the commands of Jesus unless you've read them and memorized them and passed a test showing that you've memorized them? Your organization has been around a lot longer than you. It's been glorifying the triune God a lot longer than you have. Even that year divides by three. Every name in the history thereof divides by three. You are what is called an employee. That divides by three. And eight. In eight letters and triple eight strokes. It's, it's all perfect. But you need to confess the Lordship of Jesus Christ in order to serve righteously and pleasingly before the throne of heaven and the throne of David, which is the British monarchy. Look, who is your executive? Who is your commissioner in chief? Who is at the top? Who is at the top, sir? Who is at the top? I'll show you who's at the top. She is at the top. And she confesses Jesus Christ every single year at Christmas time in her speech. And her full birth name is none other than King for the number three. 15 times 15, the perfect square of 15, which is King for the number three. It's the center letter of God, the center letter of Jehovah. And every single part of her name is glorious. Elizabeth, 88. Alexandra, 80. That's pure eights, the number of letters, screams out the number three. And then Mary is triple eight by the law of prime, a triple of the eighth prime. That's why she's the queen. She is what we call the head of the police force. She is the executive. She is the top. She is the monarch. She is the one that you serve. And if you don't serve her, if you were to deny the queen and blaspheme the king and the, the queen, you would be thrown out of your occupation and your paycheck and everything immediately. You would be this ja this badge would be ripped away from you. Well, God is even higher than the queen. So if you dishonor God and you dishonor Jesus Christ and we have a police force that isn't confessing Jesus Christ, away with your badge. You are unworthy of this badge. Amen equals 33. The man of God has spoken. And the current date and time that this was prophesied is right there. It screams up the number three brilliantly.